Hi artists! Today we're going to be creating a drawing of a penguin with different facial expressions. A facial expression is how your face looks when you're feeling different things. To begin, we're going to start by drawing the hat that our penguin is going to be wearing. So find the top of your paper, and notice my paper is standing up tall like this. It's not sideways like this. So I'm going to find the top and I'm going to draw a rectangle that has curved corners like this. Then I'm going to draw a curved line like a rainbow and a little bumpy line for the top of the hat. Now I'm ready to draw the face of the penguin. I'm going to draw two curved lines And then I'm going to find the middle of the space that I created with the curved lines and I'm going to draw an oval and this is going to be the beak of the penguin. Now I'm going to draw two lines like I'm drawing a heart, but the two lines are not going to connect with each other. So I'm going to draw one side of the heart like this and then it's not going to connect. I'm going to make a space here and draw the other side of the heart. Then I'm going to draw two circles for the eyes. Now it's time to decide what kind of emotion your penguin is feeling. What is their facial expression going to be looking like? So if they're angry, the eyebrows might be straight lines like this. If they're sad, the eyebrows might be curved going up like this. My penguin is going to be happy, so I'm going to draw two high eyebrows, like she's raising her eyebrows high. Then I'm going to draw two little circles inside the eyes and color the bigger part in. Now in the beak, we're going to draw two little lines for the nose and then think about what the mouth looks like. If your penguin is sad, it's going to be a frown. If it's angry, maybe it's a straight line. If it's feeling silly, maybe your penguin's tongue is sticking out. Since mine is happy, I'm going to draw a smile. Next, we're going to draw the scarf. So we're going to draw the same type of shape that we used for the hat, but it's going to be skinnier. Kind of like a rectangle with curved corners. And then we're going to draw two wavy lines to show the scarf going out. Lastly, we're going to draw the body by drawing a point on this side and a point on this side because penguins have flippers, not feathered wings. And then the lines go down. Last, I'm going to draw one more curved line to create the tummy of the penguin. Now it's time for you to make your drawing your own. Add details, designs on the hat and the scarf, and color it however you'd like. 